Tiny Hamster is a Giant Monster by Joel Jensen, Joseph Matsushima, and Amy Matsushima. Tiny Hamster is a Giant Monster. One cloudy day, Tiny Hamster went out to find a bite to eat. Tiny Hamster was always hungry, you see, and today was no different. A storm was coming, but Tiny Hamster could only think about food. His tummy grumbled and mumbled and tumbled around inside him. That's when he saw it, a bright orange tub full of neon green ooze. It looked delicious. Just as Tiny Hamster's tiny tongue touched the ooze, a bolt of lightning streaked down from the sky, swallowing him up in brightness. Tiny Hamster's mouth felt numb, his eyes went wide, his ears twitched, his tummy grumbled and mumbled and tumbled around inside him. He felt himself inflate like a big balloon that kept getting bigger, like a blimp, Noah Zeppelin! His paws grew huge and clumsy, as he could feel sharp spikes spring out of his back, then he turned green. Tiny Hamster had become a giant monster, worse yet, he was even hungrier than before. So he did what any hungry giant monster would do. He went to the city and ate everything in sight. He chomped on some trees. They were very good. A train rolled past and he ate it. It was tasty. He spotted a billboard and gobbled it right up. Yum. Tiny Hamster the giant monster took a bite right out of a building. He nibbled another one but it toppled over. Whoops. Tiny Hamster the giant monster was still hungry. He climbed right up a skyscraper to see what else there was to eat. Helicopters tuk 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 through the air, hovering around his head. Tiny Hamster the giant monster scarfed him straight out of the sky. One helicopter carried a giant orange tub full of green ooze. It looked delicious. But the helicopter began to fly away. Tiny Hamster, the giant monster, followed it. Soon the delicious green ooze was within reach. Tiny Hamster, the, green, the giant monster, could already taste it. Just as the giant monster's giant tongue touched the ooze, a bolt of lightning streaked down from the sky, swallowing him up in brightness. His mouth felt numb, his eyes went wide, his ears twitched, his tummy grumbled and mumbled and tumbled around inside him. He felt himself shrink like a leaky balloon. No, like a tired blowfish. Tiny Hamster the Giant Monster had become the Tiny Hamster the Tiny Hamster again. Better yet, he was finally full. Now it was time for dessert. The end.